once i click on remove and i click on as you can see i have the option to remove this domain i click on remove domain so as you can see congratulations to me my domain has been removed from this business manager Hello guys, it's your boy Christian Omeje of Optic Digital Hub and today in this video I'll be showing you how to remove your website domain from a restricted Facebook business manager account. But before we fully jump into the video for today, if you are here to subscribe to the channel, now will be the right time to do so. Just click on the subscribe button to subscribe now and click on the bell icon to turn on your notifications so you get notified when I drop brand new videos just like this one. So as you can see right here on my screen, one of my business manager accounts in my Facebook has been restricted, meaning that I can no longer run ads on the Facebook platform using this business manager. If you look at this part, Facebook say you can no longer advertise using Facebook product. This is our final decision. But the issue right now is that I have a domain which I have configured web events on this business manager and I cannot remove this domain. So let me just show you. Let me go over to my business settings and show you the domain. I was trying to remove the domain, but I was given a pop up that I cannot remove this domain because I have set up web event for this domain. So right here on your business settings, just go over to your brand safety, click on domains. And as you can see, this is the domain. It's a verified domain here. And if I click on this remove option right here, this is what I get. This domain is configured for up to, to optimize for web events using aggregated event measurements. To remove the domain from this Facebook business account, you need to first of all delete the event in the configuration in Event Manager. So now, most times we all get confused. Even the first time I saw this, I got confused. Like, how can I bypass this to remove my domain? Do I need to start buying a new domain? Because that's what a lot of people do. But in this quick video, I'm going to show you the easiest and fastest way to remove your domain from this restricted Facebook business manager without stress. There are two ways to do it. But in this video, I will show you the fastest way that you can achieve this. Just click on this option right here this hamburger icon right here and go to event manager click on events manager so once it loads up you will see your pixel this is your pixel area you see your pixel here that you used to set up in your business manager but right here come over to this point here which says uh, tax center data source click on custom conversions so once you click here, if you have created any custom conversion before, you are going to see it right here. But if you have not created any one, let's just say we we'll start from scratch. But if I click on it, if I click on this one, you can see the option and they said configure for me to configure aggregated event measurement. And you can see I have not configured this one. If I click on it, I can start to configure it. But I just want to show you, for example, if you have not done this, let's click on like creating a new custom conversion just name it anything just name it new and just bypass it and just put a website domain there let me just put um blue.com let it just be this is something we are just doing for official purpose then i will choose the traffic oh, sorry i'll choose my let me just say i'm optimizing for lead so if i'm optimizing for lead you just choose what you're trying to optimize for then once you're done just click on create right here this is just you're going to still delete this at the end of the day once you are done just click on done then as you can see you see the new one right here then it's the same thing you just come over to this aggregated event management area and click on configure So once you click on configure, you are going to see 
this option right here for the ones that you have done before then you just click on manage events you understand just click on manage events you are going to see your domain right here. just click on manage events and it's going to say that if you change this you cannot do it in the next 72 hours just click on edit so as you can see right here this is the one that i have done before you understand if it's for you you will have to add a new one but probably you must have done one so all you just have to do is click on this x icon and once i remove it i will save it and apply it and i can now remove my domain so this is just what you need to remove to be able to remove your domain so i'm going to click on this x right here and as you can see there's no web event here anymore there's no configured web event all i just do is click on apply it say do you want to save i just click on yes i understand and i'll click on apply so as you can see it's done so what i just have to do right now is go back to my business settings so right here in my business settings i'll go back to brand safety i click on domains so this was that domain that i could not remove but right now i'm going to click on remove so once I click on remove and I click on, as you can see, I have the option to remove this domain. I will click on remove domain. So as you can see, congratulations to me, my domain has been removed from this business manager. So guys, that is it on how you can successfully remove any website domain in a restricted Facebook business manager account with ease this is like the fastest method that you can use to do this so if you enjoyed this video ensure that you give the channel a boost by subscribing to the channel commenting on this video and giving this video a like so this video can grow on the YouTube algorithm see you next time guys as I bring you amazing videos just like this